Connecticut. People that go to the border, they look professionals, and they said there's never been anything like this in the history of the world, and they're destroying — they are destroying the fabric of our country. She did nothing to stop any of it. In fact, she encouraged them to keep coming, and you know that. For years, she did. Only recently did she say, oh, well, we're going to try and put a stop to it. And I ask again, you know, this should be the why didn't she do it speech. Why didn't she do it? All of these things, including unrelated elements to what we're talking about now, like taxes, like military, like so many other things. Why didn't she do it? She's got plans for the future. Why didn't she do it? She's been there almost four years. Kamala created a brand new program to fly in migrants from Venezuela, Haiti, and Nicaragua and resettle them in American communities, including small towns all across our nation, but in particular in Pennsylvania, Ohio, Wisconsin, and North Carolina. Nobody can believe it. These towns have been destroyed and the mayors of the towns and the governors of the states can't talk about it because they're embarrassed that they allowed it to happen. In addition, through her phone app, something totally new now, it's a phone app for migrants, where migrants call in, highly sophisticated migrants. She's allowed virtually unlimited numbers of illegals to press a button schedule their illegal immigration appointment at our ports of entry and show up to be released into the interior of our country. Can anybody believe this? And they're invading our towns. It's an invasion of our country like no country has ever had to suffer before. And this was purposeful. They did this on purpose. This was not a mistake on their part. They did this on purpose because their policies are so wrong and so evil and so unbelievable.